Hi guys, today I'm going to show you how to copy your physical DVDs to a hard disk. Are you tired of constantly dealing with scratched or damaged DVDs? Or tired of lugging around a bulky DVD player while traveling? These are common frustrations for users who have a large collection of DVDs. But fear not, there is a solution to these pains copying DVDs to your hard drive. By doing so, you can protect and preserve your precious DVD collection while also enjoying the convenience of digital storage. And in this ever-evolving technology landscape, a reliable and efficient tool like Video Proc Converter can help make this process even smoother. It should be noted that the steps for using DVD function to copy the DVD to a hard disk on both Mac and Windows computer are the same when using Video Pro Converter. The link to download Video Pro Converter is in the description. You can check it out. So if you love what we do, please subscribe to help our channel grow. Once you downloaded and installed Video Pro Converter, just open it and it will present you with this welcome screen. And the feature that you're going to select is DVD. And because this video focuses on copying your physical DVD to a hard disk, you're going to make some changes to the settings first. So you're going to go to preferences right here and you click on DVD and for the video output folder, you may want to replace it. So we click on the pencil icon right here. And now I scroll down to find my hard disk, which is an external SSD right here. This external SSD is a two terabyte SSD, which can store tons of videos converted from a collection of DVDs. So once I select that, I click on open and now my new video output folder is my external hard disk once you're done changing that you can quit it and now it's time to copy your physical dvd to your hard disk so at the top menu there are three options you can copy it from a disk folder or iso in my situation i have a disk so i select disk here and as you can see it automatically select my dvd called 12k animals film so i just click on done here start analyzing and now it recognizes it. and the output video format is mp4 you want to make changes to the video output format you can do so as well by going to target format right here is a place where you can modify the video format to mp4 mov avi mkv and so on it support hundreds of video formats but in my case, I would love to choose MP4 as my video format, so I leave it that way. Next, if you want to make changes to your video codec and video resolution, you move your cursor down to the MP4 format that has been selected right here and double click on it. Here they show you the profile setting where you can make changes to the video quality, video codec options and audio codec options. So we'll start with the video quality. So it's recommended that you move this to slow so that it will convert your video in a high quality mode for video codec options it's recommended to keep everything original because video pro converter has already selected the best options for you you don't have to make any changes to it unless you're sure what you're doing just like the audio codec options leave it the way it is if you want to change it you can do so as well but only do so if you're sure what you're doing once everything is done you click on done here next if you want to edit your videos first before you copy or convert the DVD to MP before and put it on your hard disk you just move your cursor up here to the word edit so right here is a place where you can edit the video first you can put some effect on it you can also edit the audio volume or rotate the video left and right you can also put subtitles to the video cut the video crop the video or even put watermark to it so after you're done editing the video you click on done here we'll take a look at the right hand side right here you can see they say hardware acceleration engine right here video prop converter makes use of your processor to make the conversion process faster so if you have supported processor it will tick like that it shows that my processor is supported so it will boost the conversion process next it is also recommended to tick this option saying use high quality engine with this feature tick it will ensure that your video is converted in a high quality mode so before we click on run to start the conversion process we just have to take one last look at the output folder so the output folder is now my external hard disk so after it finish converting it will automatically copy the converted video to my external hard disk so once you confirm that you click on run to start the process so now you just wait for it it won't take long
Now the conversion process is done, it shows me this file right here that has been converted already. So as you can see that it has been converted and copied directly into my external SSD. So let's see what it looks like. So as you can see there, that the video quality looks great. So with Video Pro Converter, you can copy or convert as many physical DVDs as you want to to your external hard disk so that you can use it on the go. Video Pro Converter also provides you with other features including video which is used to convert from one video format to other video formats. It supports more than 400 videos formats. You can also do screen recording to record your iPad, your iPhone or even your Mac or Windows computer screen using this feature call recorder. Also, if you're interested in learning more how to use Video Pro Converter more effectively, especially topics like how to play a DVD on a TV without a DVD player, or best video splitter in 2024, or a complete tutorial for beginners of how to use Video Pro Converter effectively, I have included the links to watch them in the description below. Please check them out if you're interested. So if you love what we do, please give us a thumbs up, comment down below of your thought, and subscribe to help our channel grow. Thank you so much for watching. Have a great day guys, see you in the next video.